Good morning, boys and girls. Thank you for joining with me this weekend as we read from another story. I don't know if you've ever heard this said to you at all by parents or maybe a teacher, but this is about something that all of us have a hard time with sometimes. God, I need to talk to you about paying attention. Well, here we are. Dear God, once again, I missed out on a lot of fun today. I know the reason why, and it's my fault. I have trouble paying attention. This morning, I was supposed to go with my friend Rick and his mother to play ball, have a picnic, and then go roller skating. I told mom I was supposed to be at Rick's house at 10 o'clock. We went shopping first and got to Rick's house 10 minutes early. There was no one there. They had already left without me. I was so hurt, I cried. After supper, Rick's mom telephoned and asked mom why I was not there at 9 o'clock. I told Jimmy three times that we were leaving at 9 o'clock, she said. Mom said, he has a problem. Jimmy worries so much about himself that he doesn't always pay attention. God, mom's right. I do worry so much about myself that I don't pay attention to others. I even get poor grades in school because I don't listen. God, I miss out on a lot of things. Sometimes things go wrong because I do not pay attention. Mom says that you gave me ears for a reason. Dear Jesus, help me use the ears you gave me. Forgive me when I think only about myself and don't care about others or pay attention to them. I am thankful that you pay attention to me, and that you're not too busy to hear me. Thank you for loving me and for forgiving my sins. You really do care about me. And thank you for my ears. Amen. Well, boys and girls, remember this week, in school, at home, playing out in the neighborhood or wherever you might be, to try to pay attention a little bit more, knowing and understanding that God pays perfect attention to you and loves you forever. May his peace be with you.